Tonight, we're going to start off with new details in that controversial Windsor traffic stop. The former Windsor police officer, Joe Gutierrez, has filed a motion to dismiss the lawsuit against him. You may remember Army Lieutenant Karen Nazario filed it after that violent traffic stop. Last month, we showed you the body camera video showing Nazario getting threatened and pepper sprayed during the December stop. Nazario ended up facing zero charges. Reporter Angelo Vargas brings us the latest developments. The lawyers for former Windsor police officer Joe Gutierrez filed a partial motion to dismiss the complaint on Friday. They say the facts don't match up with the complaint. According to court documents, attorneys John Mumford and Corrine Silverman believe former officer Joe Gutierrez did not violate any First Amendment rights. In the document, it says Army 2nd Lieutenant Corona Nazario's complaint fails based on facts. The legal counsels describe three reasons defending why Gutierrez did not violate Nazario's constitutional rights. One, the plaintiff engaged in constitutionally protected First Amendment activity, such as speech. Two, the defendant's actions caused the plaintiff to suffer an injury that would chill a person of ordinary firmness from continuing to engage in the protected activity. And three, there was a casual relationship between the plaintiff's protective activity and the defendant's conduct. However, the community in the town of Windsor and the Isle of Wight County NAACP disagree with the actions of the two police officers. On Friday, some of the chapter members marched at the state capitol in Richmond demanding police accountability and that the Isle of Wight Commonwealth's attorney to recuse herself from the case. We spoke to attorney Mumford this afternoon. He explained he did not want to comment because of pending litigation in Norfolk. Angelo Vargas, 13 News Now. Right now, Virginia State Police are conducting a criminal investigation into that traffic stop, and Hampton's Commonwealth's attorney will act as a special prosecutor into the investigation and prosecution.